and show you how I improve my splits. So, I'm just going to show you how I stretch a little bit. My room's kind of... Well, it's not... It looks messy in the camera, but it's really not messy. It's just my dance and my school bags and my hamper over there. So, it's not really messy, but I'm just going to show you. So, first, I am going to put my legs in front of me and stretch forward. I am really, really tight right now. I'm sore. Stretch out your hamstrings and behind your knees. And you can, can't really see. But when you're there, you can like point and flex your feet and roll through. And it'll help with your point. So that. And then you can put one foot in front of the other, or you can do like put it on top. And, um, stretch forward and it'll stretch like like right here and it feels really good but sometimes you won't feel anything because it's already stretched out back there but sometimes it really feels really good and just switch and then to put one foot out and one foot bent and you can reach towards this leg And reach in front. And switch. And then you can do this, and it'll stretch out your hips. If your legs aren't, some people's legs are up here, but um, if they're close to the ground. Hold your feet and use your elbows to push them down and stretch forward. And it'll stretch out your hips. Um, and then you can open your legs into a second. And stretch to the sides. You can stretch like this. You can stretch in front of your leg, but like front, and then go into the middle. And you can even open your center a little more and stretch all those things again. Um, and then you can lunge and go up. And like bend your legs and stretch them out and do this. Rock back and forth. You can even go onto your front foot and kick up into a six o'clock. And you can do like that. And come back down. And you can do a split out of it if you want. And then the other side. The sides are really tight. Try to keep both legs parallel. Don't have your like back foot out like that because it's a different stretch. And then for center, you can stretch out your hips by doing the frog stretch and just have your legs out like this. Or you can lay on your stomach and try to keep your feet on the floor with your, with your hips on the ground. And you can stretch for your center. Just like you can roll through, like, like roll through. And like lay on your back. Well, I, can, I don't really have much room. But that. And those are stretches that, like, before I do my splits, I get. And then, um, you can do some heel stretches. You can hold something, a shelf or like the wall, and um, just grab your leg and pull it up. Don't want to knock over the thing. 
but I stretch it and I stretch it like I grab if I'm really good then I grab the tops of my toes and stretch it up and you can grab it with the other hand and you can stretch it like a tilt and do the other side and all that and you can do your dancer's pose you can split up the wall and the farther away the more over split stretch you get but that's what I do to help me with my splits and to get a better stretch for my splits there's some other ways but I don't want to make this video super long so I hope this helps and I'm really out of breath. So I'll see you guys next week.